Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my wash day routine, which I do kind of change it up every once in a while. I may add new products or stop using old products, but I am going to stick to some of, some of my staples. Okay, I have my hair divided into four sections. Well, yeah, four sections. So I have the two sections in the back that is not twisted and pinned back. And then I got the two sections front. I'm going to show you how I do the sections in the front, not my whole head because it's roughly the same. But first, I'm going to finger detangle my hair. So what I'm going to use to finger detangle my hair is this little concoction that I kind of got from the maximum hydration method basically it's water and conditioner I filled the conditioner to about this point which is why it's so cloudy and you actually see pieces of conditioner in there I don't know if you can see it but I, I did that I put the conditioner in first which I find helps like shake it up better as well as I use extremely hot water like as hot as the sink how hot as the faucet will get. I don't boil the water because I think that would be too hot. But I use really hot water because it helps to open up the cuticles in my hair. So better moisturization, better penetration. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this bobby pin out. And I'm just going to, as soon as it come out, Spray it. I'm starting at my root and just working it down. Interesting. And it smells so good. Actually, see the conditioner. So just so my sections won't get. So I'm just gonna put the body pin over the top part of the back. Okay, the conditioner that I I only use one conditioner. Conditioner when I was doing the maximum hydration method, I used like multiple conditioners to mix, but I'm only using. This one by Garnier, Garnier Fruities, which is the triple, triple nutrition. It has avocado, olive, and almond oils. It's for dry to very dry hair. Three times the moisture as well as a strength system. It's paraben free. Like, I, I like this. I've used this one as well as the one specifically for curls. Which is like, I like, so. And I really don't like their products like that, but these conditioners I do like. It's very moisturizing for my curls. So, I'm going to get my hair saturated. Okay. And once... I did that. Just going to rub it in and just start to lightly finger the tangle. This and just fill. This is also could be a pre poo, but I don't really pre poo. I find it it really does nothing for my hair. Because I don't use very dry shampoos. So, and look at that. My hair has been out the last couple of days. And I was not able to run my fingers through this at all. But, I just love it. First, I'm just getting shit hair off my fingers. Like I just, I don't want to put it back into my hair.
I'll just show you guys. And this is roughly how much shed hair I've gotten from this one section. Which is not bad because my hair sheds a lot. Like, So, now that this is all moisturized. I'm going to twist it up and then start on the next section. And I will see you guys when I'm done. Okay guys, so I'm back. I've rinsed out the conditioner and used a t-shirt and my hair Still has a little bit of condition in it, but you know. So, oh man, I forgot my shampoo. Just hold on one second. Okay, so now I'm going to shampoo my hair. I am going to use the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Shampoo. It's the strengthening, strengthen and grow shampoo with peppermint and apple cider vinegar. Restore and renew natural chemical process color treated or heat style hair. Sulfate free and color safe. So this is what I'm going to use. As you can see, I've used quite a bit of it, but I honestly do not like it that much. I'm just using it because it's the only shampoo that I have. So I'm just going to put it on my scalp and just put it everywhere just muscle, and then just as you can see it subs up really nice but I don't know my hair just it cleans it, but it still, it makes it feel dry, which is weird because I've never had that with Shea Moisture Shampoo. It always left my hair feeling clean, but soft and not dry, but this one makes my hair feel dry. So, I'm just going to basically make sure my scalp it's clean so I just separate it and massage make sure all of my hair is covered and then I'm just gonna move on to the next section okay I feel like this is pretty clean so I'll be back when I wash this out. Okay, so I'm back. My hair is clean. My scalp is clean. Look at that. Okay, so now it's time to do a protein treatment and okay, <laughs> deep conditioner. So first I am going to Deep condition because my hair feels a little dry. And I'm going to use the Ozzy's 3 Minute Moist. 3 Minute Miracle Moist one. And this is a deep conditioner. I love this. And I'm glad that I don't have to sit for like 20 minutes. It makes my wash day so much shorter. And then I'm going to use the... A, I don't know how to say this. But it's the... Keratin 2 Minute Reconstructor. It adds strength and softness in one step, step quick and effective against heat and chemical damage. So I love this. Once again, really short. And with this, I will use this. I usually use this every week, but because I did pick up the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Deep Conditioner that also has keratin in it, I do not want to overload my hair. So when I start using that, I will use it. I will switch them out like every other week. But definitely do this every week for me. I don't know about you, but I will be back when I have done both steps and come back. All right. Okay guys, I've just rinsed everything out. 
and this is my hair like you see look at the shine and the curls are like popping look at that yep and my hair feels nice and moisturized and soft and strong so all I'm gonna do now is put in my leave-in which is the Shea Moisture Argan Oil and Almond Milk Smooth and Tame Thermal Protect Milk with Marshmallow Root Extract and Churamoya, I think that's how you say it. This is what I'm using. I really like it and it smells wonderful. But that's my wash day routine. It takes me about 45 minutes to an hour depending on how bad my hair is tangled. But that is the end. So I will see you guys in my next video. Please stay tuned. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. See you guys.